Good evening, this is Gabriel Jackson, and welcome to Halacha Day, number 1030. Halacha Day keeps the eights our wave, and we're so excited. We're learning a new chapter, the laws of blessings on foods made of the five species of grain. If bread that is made from the five species of grain, which again are wheat, barley, oat, rye, and spelt, was made as kisnen. What's kisnen? We're going to learn more about it tomorrow, but according to some authorities, kisnen is bread made in the shape of pockets filled with fruit, meat, or cheese, or with similar things. Or when it's made like a strudel, fruits and nuts rolled in dough and baked. So let's say you had this type of bread that's made from the five species and was made into this type of kisnen, and you eat less than the quantity sufficient for a meal, then it does not require a teal sedaim. Normally before you eat bread, you wash your hands, you make al sedaim, you make hamotzi over the bread. Not, you don't need to do that. What do you do? You just make the blessing Bremen Amazonas, which is the blessing we make over cake or oatmeal or spaghetti or pretzels or now this type of kisnen. And you make the appropriate after blessing alamechna, which again is the after blessing when you have cake, spaghetti, oatmeal, etc. However, if you know you're going to have a lot of this kisnen, you're going to eat the amount sufficient for a meal, then it's governed by the same law as regular bread. Then you got to wash those hands. Make Gantil Sadaim, make Amotzi, and then say the Birkas Amazon, the blessing we say after eating bread. Okay, so we got it. That's the law of Kisnen. We'll learn more about it tomorrow. Thanks for listening to the sponsor, Feature Halacha 36100 for the gold. See you tomorrow.